Hello friends, welcome to Engineering Funda family. In this video, I'll be going to compare clipper circuits and clamper circuits. In the video lecture series of basic electronics, I have already covered clipper and clamper circuits in great details. Here I'll be comparing clipper and clamper circuits based on different parameters. So let us compare clipper and clamper circuits with respect to working first. See when it comes to clipper circuit, at that time we will be clipping waveform at output side. Like for example if you have input waveform that is sinusoidal, then with that input waveform you can clip positive part of waveform or negative part of waveform. If you clip positive part of input waveform at output side then that will be positive clipper and if you clip negative part of waveform at output side then that will be negative clipper. But when it comes to clamper circuit at that time you will be shifting DC level of given input signal. Like if you have input signal that is sinusoidal waveform and if you increase DC level of input signal by positive DC voltage then that will be positive clamper. If you shift DC level of entire input signal at output side by negative voltage then that will be negative clamper. Right. See second parameter is output voltage. See with clipper circuit we don't increase voltage more than input. At output side we will be just clipping voltage. We will be not increasing voltage over here. Right. While with clamper circuit you will be observing output may be more than input. Right. Like if your input voltage that is varying from minus Vm to plus Vm then after positive clamper with Vm DC shifting voltage will be varying from 0 to 2 Vm. So here we are increasing voltage up to 2 Vm. Right. See third parameter is energy storage element. See when it comes to energy storage element then that we use it in clamper circuit. We use clap capacitor right while with clipper circuit we don't use any energy storage element. We are just using diodes and resistors only in clipper circuit while with clamper circuit we use energy storage element like capacitor right. See next parameter is shape of output. See in clipper circuit we will be changing shape of output. So output shape will change right like you will be clipping positive half of waveform or you may be clipping negative half of waveform. So shape of output that will change. In clamper circuit we don't change shape of output only we are shifting DC level of input signal at output side right. So in clipper circuit we will be changing shape in clamper circuit shape will remain same only DC level that is getting changed right. See next is DC level of output so with clipper circuit DC level will remain same DC level will not change with clipper circuit. And with clamper circuit DC level will change and shape will remain same that is how things are there right. When it comes to applications then with clipper circuit we can use it as a noise limiter and for that one example also I have explained in my earlier videos of basic, basic electronics lecture series in which I have explained how we can limit the noise with the use of clipper circuits. See clamper circuit that one can use it for voltage multiplier. Like if you have voltage which is maximum by Vm then you can have it as per 2 Vm you can multiply the voltage even right. So here applications are as per noise limiter with clipper circuit and with clamper circuit we can use it as a voltage multiplier right. So that is how comparison is there I hope you have understood this still if anything you would like to share please note it down in comment section I will be happy to help you thank you so much for watching this video.